What's up everyone? Welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited about today's video because it has been very requested since I had my baby shower, which was now like a month ago. I've been kind of waiting to just have the time to sit down and actually film this. And all of these gifts have been sitting here and I've been wanting to like do laundry and pack things away. And I'm just, every single time I'm about to do it, I'm like, oh wait, I have to film this video before I put everything away. So I think two videos ago, I did like some baby essentials and a ton of you guys actually gave me such good recommendations but I forgot to mention in that video that I actually did get some things from my baby shower I just hadn't shown them for example this right here is a sound machine and I think this was like the top comment to get a sound machine which I had already had but I didn't think about like putting it in the video because I forgot that it was just like a baby shower gift I feel like I kind of did everything out of order which is basically my brain right now everything is just so out of order before I get into this video I just want to say a huge thank you to you guys for being so patient with all of my like random videos and a lot of sponsorships. I'm doing more than normal. This video is not sponsored by the way, but I'm doing more than normal just because this is my full-time job and I want to make sure that I have a lot saved because Dan and I are taking a break once the baby's here from any sponsorships. So we're not going to be really making money for a little bit because we just want to take time to be like with our baby. We're still going to be uploading on YouTube, just nothing sponsored and we don't make much money off of views. So us taking a break from like sponsorships and campaigns and stuff is definitely definitely was stressing me out but now that I've like kind of done a bunch beforehand I feel like we've been able to save and thank you so much for being so patient and so understanding with that it has been a dream I normally would never do that but it was just something that I was like I need to take a break from work because obviously a lot more work and stuff goes into a sponsored video and you're not really like working for yourself you're working for a different brand I'm rambling so I'm gonna get into this video but I did get a lot of questions from you guys on how I knew what to ask for my baby shower and what to put on my registry so what I did was I literally went on YouTube and watched videos like this I watched people haul what they got from their baby showers and talk about baby essentials and I just wrote down a list of things I didn't have already and things I knew I needed to buy and I just put those on my registry now some people really followed the registry and some people didn't but that's totally fine because you're gonna see I have a few doubles of things but that's okay because I can keep some stuff here I can keep some stuff at my parents or at my uh, parents-in-law's house so that when the baby goes there for like a sleepover eventually they can have like some of their favorite things so it works out really well okay let's get into this so i'm going to start off with this thing which i just showed this is the hatch baby rest sound machine nightlight and time to rise i don't know how this compares to other sound machines i've never used the sound machine before but reviews were great i'll probably just use white noise but yeah a lot of people recommended this so that's why i got this one there's a lot of stuff here holy crap okay the next thing was i got this basket and in this basket was a bunch of little gifts so the first one being this little toy which my cousin the reason why i know it's my cousin is because it's her handwriting and she wrote baby's first vibrator <laughs> that's what we called this teether but it seriously saved us with our kids. This is a great gift. I'm excited. Dan and I, when we do buy products, we are going to try to buy things that are mainly sustainable or like made out of wood or silicone or things like that. Um, not so much plastic or things with like noise or sounds. I know that like goes against the sound machine, but I'm talking about toys just so you guys know like where our heads are at, but I'm not going to like be opposed if people buy us gifts. I'm not going to be like, you can't buy us that or you can't buy us that. Like totally buy us whatever you want, but that's just kind of like when we buy for ourselves, you'll see see kind of a theme. Another toy which um, is super talked about is this like giraffe thing which I see everywhere and I think my friend got this for me. Oops. <laughs> um, it's basically like a silicone giraffe teether thing so that's really cool. It's cute. Uh, a lot of people have raved about it, so I'm excited to try that. I hope the baby likes it. I don't know. We are going to be using a pacifier for the baby, which brings me to this next thing, which are these, they're called bibs. Like the brand is called bibs, but they're these little pacifiers, sussies, binkies, whatever you guys call them, size one. And they're really cute colors. And then they came with these, or I got them with these really cute pacifier clips, which are totally on brand for like what I like. Then, oh my God, this is so cute. I think my mom got this for me. It's like a little foot that you put a picture in. It's so cute. Okay, this is really, really cute. I got this. It's like a bib for the for the baby that says the dog did it and then a bib for the dog that says the baby did it. And if you can see in the picture here, them together, I think that would be such a cute photo once the baby's old enough to like sit up and wear a bib um, to have Boo and him take a picture together. <laughs> okay, this thing is actually, I'm kind of excited about it. This is a like milk warmer. So you could put a bottle in here and it 
warms up your milk. It also can warm baby food. So I don't know if this is like an essential, but a lot of people have said this is really good. So we'll, we will see. The next gift I got was this lollipop baby camera. I haven't opened it yet, but this is basically to spy on your baby. No, it's to make sure that it's kind of like a modern day, what's the word I'm looking for? Baby monitor. Dang, I can't think. If I seem really off in this video, my brain is so jumbled right now. I have never experienced this in my life. So I'm like really happy and excited, but also like don't know what's going on. <laughs> It's like a modern day baby monitor. It sets up with your phone. I believe I saw Aspen and Parker using this and I got inspired by that. So I added it to my baby registry. I don't remember who got me this, but thank you because I'm very excited to use it. I also got this like bottle bag. It's kind of a cooler inside that you can keep bottles and it straps to the outside of your stroller. So um, if you're going on walks or something, you're going to the park, you can bring this along with you. If your diaper bag doesn't hold them, I think this is really convenient and can be really helpful and then I think it also comes with reusable freezer packs for your breast milk which is so key so this is gonna come in handy I know because Dan and I especially if we're traveling or something and are gonna want to be doing something out once the baby's older it's gonna be really convenient to have something like that not have to like shove everything in one diaper bag we can kind of have a diaper bag full of necessities and then this like bottle cooler this thing right here I have this like play gym which is made out of wood which is so cute had actually put this on the registry because I wanted some little wooden things to hang from it. So it just goes over your baby, kind of like as they're laying on their play mat and they're looking up, they can kind of look at these little wooden shapes. There's an elephant. There's this one that has a different ring on it, um, a birdie, a circle, and I just think this is gonna be really cute for the baby to look at. The next big essential is this, which I'm very excited for. This is a breastfeeding pillow. So what you would do is you'd kind of have it on your lap, and as you are breastfeeding, the baby rests on this pillow. So it makes it a lot more comfortable for the baby and a lot more comfortable for you, so you're not holding up the baby every single time. Especially if you're sitting in a chair like this, it just really helps. So many of these videos that I watched recommended this on it there's all these like animals which is so cute there and then it says happy baby and there's some stars and clouds and I just think it's so cute then I got a bunch of books which is so sweet so I'll show you a few of them I got some dr. Seuss books which is awesome I love dr. Seuss this was actually my cousin's kids first baby book which they wrote on of it wrote on of it oh my god I can't talk they wrote on it that it was the first baby book which I think is so cute so we got something like that and then um, actually a co-worker from my mom's work and his girlfriend gifted me this which is so sweet it's called that's not my elephant and it's a texture book which I think is so cool so every single page has different textures on it and like there's furry and scratchy and soft and stuff so as you're reading to your baby you can have them kind of feel everything and see the different textures which I think is so smart then we did get <laughs> two of the love you forever books one hardcover, one soft cover, which I'm totally fine with because this is my favorite book. I loved it as a kid. It still makes me cry to this day. Also reminds me of Joey from Friends. Yeah, so like I said, one at my parents' house, one here, so they can read to the baby the same book. I think it's so cute. Oh, I love this book. And then this one actually my aunt gifted me and she said it was my older cousin's first baby book, which is so cute. So it's called Good Morning Sun and then Every single page has like things you can lift and look at, open. I'm very excited and I think that's such a sweet gesture to get some books that are kind of like hand-me-downs and meaningful to people in my family. I just thought that was such a sweet little gift. And then this again is another baby book called Someday, I have not read it. And then the last kind of book that I got, which is not really a book to read, but it's, um, I have hair in my mouth. It's a baby memory book and it says, hello world, there's an elephant on it. And it's just, you fill it out, you can add pictures. It's funny because I actually saw this book at chapters and I was gonna buy it. But then I thought, you know what? I'm gonna wait until my baby shower because I just have a feeling someone might get me this because they know I like elephants. And then my friend did, so. Yay. <laughs> and I get a lot of questions about my like obsession with elephants or if the baby's name is gonna have to do something with an elephant. No, um, actually elephants aren't even my favorite animals. <laughs> I love them. I think they're so beautiful and gentle and kind. But what happened was I actually had this like elephant toy before I got pregnant and I was telling Daniel, oh, if I ever get pregnant, like this is such a cute toy. I'll give this to our baby one day. And then my mom had gone to Ikea and bought me this like big stuffed animal elephant, which I keep in the crib because it's so cute. And 
then I think someone else got me something with an elephant on it. And then I started posting a lot of pictures of the nursery with the elephant in it. So a lot of people thought that I like loved elephants and then it just kind of went from there. So no, the baby's name has nothing to do with an elephant. And the reason why now everything is like elephant themed is because of literally what I just said, but they are so cute and so gentle. And I just think they go so well with baby things. So it made me happy. And speaking of elephants, <laughs> I got two different elephant things. It's so soft and cuddly. I love stuffed animals. I always have ever since I was a kid and I'm never gonna stop. And then this is a elephant infant hoodie towel. I got another toy. This is actually from the New York girls. They just had it on the table during my like impromptu baby shower there. And then they said I could keep it. It's a Care Bear. It's so cute. I think it's a Care Bear. Is this a Care Bear? Because of the heart? Maybe it's not. Oh, it's a Build-A-Bear. I was way off. Moving on. So I did get these. These are like little wooden planks that say um, like Hello World. And then they have the months on them. So this says five months old, um, seven months old, one year old, all those things. And it's basically to take pictures with your baby when they hit different milestones. And I just thought it was so pretty. I don't even know if you can see. Can you see that? Um, and then I got something similar actually from my aunt and it's actually a blanket and on the blanket you like lay your baby out like this and then you put the square around the milestones and you could take a picture like that as well. So I thought that was really cute and kind of different. This thing I'm excited for. This is a delivery and nursing gown that was on so many people's lists. To be honest, a lot of people said that like the hospital gowns aren't the most comfortable or sometimes they're just like scratchy or whatever. So to get something that is definitely a lot more comfortable that you're able to wear that covers like your back or whatever um, it also is a nursing one so there are buttons here that you can unsnap and breastfeed which makes it easy it's a really soft material how funny is this photo by the way though <laughs> if I'm allowed to wear this beforehand I will if if not I'll wear it after um, because I you know it, I know it does get messy and stuff so maybe I'll just wear this after the baby comes I'm very excited about it so I think this is a great great gift then I got some um, crib sheets, fitted crib sheets, which are such a must because I did not have any. So I'm very excited about this because I need to get that ready. And then last but not least are a bunch of swaddles. So I got a ton of swaddle blankets, but I, I think I'm going to use them to be honest, more as like a burping cloth or breastfeeding blanket or just a blanket in general, because I do have the Ollie swaddle, which in my opinion is like the best thing to use. Anything that has like Velcro or a zipper that really keeps your baby in place just because they can get out of these But I think these are still really convenient to use so I'm very excited about it and then actually funny enough I got two of the same gift and The reason why this happened is because I had originally a baby um, Registry that was on a website and I didn't realize that like Canadians couldn't shop on it So basically I had to switch everything to an Amazon registry, but then I just forgot to delete the other one So all my American friends use the American one and all the Canadian people use the Canadian one. So that's why there was some overlap, but it's fine because I'm very excited about these. So it is Harry Potter swaddle blankets. So I got two like this and then the box like this, which comes with three. They're really pretty. It's by this brand. I don't know how to say it, but you could see here, there's one with lightning bolts and stars. And then this has clouds and the golden snitch. Um, and this one has Hedwig with a Hogwarts like envelope in his mouth, which is so cute. I'm so excited. I'm going to wash all of these afterwards and just start putting them away. Oh my goodness. I'm very, very, very excited. Other things I got that are not here. I got a ton of diapers and wipes, like so many diapers and wipes. I put that on my registry as like number one, because I know we're going to go through so many, especially with a newborn. So those are all kind of put away right now. And then I did get some cash and I did get gift cards for Amazon. And then I got also um, some checks. Sorry if the angle looks different. My camera battery just died, but I also realized I forgot to show like the most important important thing, which is a huge bag of baby clothes. So my little cousin's kid actually knitted this hat for the baby. How cute is that? And then we just got a ton of different like jammies and clothes and socks. It's 
a huge bag just filled with clothes, which is so, 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 so nice. Yeah, I need to do laundry. But it was really convenient because they got in all different sizes. So from newborn all the way up to one years old. So we definitely are set with clothes. But I hope you guys enjoy this video. I hope it's helpful. And I hope that um, if you are expecting that you take time to relax and take time for yourself. And if you're not expecting and you're just curious, like I was before I ever had kids, I watched so many pregnancy related videos just because I was like that. Then I hope you're having a great day and I love you guys so much and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye!